What's up, Flyers Nations? T today is uh, NHL game day, or uh, yeah, it is game day, the first official night of the season. Um, I just want to apologize for the last video. Um, I apologize if I wasn't all prepared, but you know when you have a lot going on, you don't plan you don't plan these things the way we should. But but today but today's video um, um, today's video I'm going to uh, is um, it's not only game day, but but it's uh, I'm making but I'm going to be doing the uh, the uh, NHL predictions. Um, um, I'm going to start off doing doing the the Eastern Conference. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to do the Western Conference, but I have everything written down on a piece of paper. But if I don't, ha if I can't, if I can't squeeze in the Western Conference, uh, then I'll do that. I'll do it on, on another. I'll make another video. So um, right now, I'm going to focus on the Eastern Conference uh, teams uh, that, um, of making the playoffs. Uh, so um, so I'm going to start off uh, doing. I'm going to start off doing the uh, Atlantic Division. In the in the Eastern Conference, um, I have Tampa Bay in first place because um, I think I think they'll have a good good year with um, with uh, Tyler with Tyler Johnson and Steven Stamkos and Vasilevsky had had a tremendous season uh, last year and uh, but I think I think they could actually go deeper in the playoffs. Um, I have Toronto in second place in, in, the, in, in the Atlantic Division because of, uh, of well, of course you have John Tavares. Um, I think he's going to do. I think he's going to do well. I, th I think he's also going to help. I think he'll he'll help out um, Austin Matthews, and um, he'll, he'll also help out uh, Marichin. And uh, and, uh, and 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 uh, and Bozak. And um, I, th I think I think that I think um, that Toronto Maple Leafs will will actually do well uh, again this year. I had the I had the Boston Bruins finishing in third place in, in the Atlantic. And um, surprisingly, this might this may knock your socks off a little bit, but I have the Ottawa Senators winning making the playoffs in fourth place. But I don't know how far the. I think I, you know, I think, you know, you have Hoffman, and um, and Matt Duchesne. So, you know, we, you know, we, you know, you 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 might be surprised that Ottawa could could make it in. I think I think I think they actually will, believe it or not. But but um, you know, I think Ottawa will make it in. Montreal, Montreal Canadiens. Uh, they'll be lucky if they could get in there, but I don't think I don't think they will. It will be a, I think it'll be a dog fight in there with uh, with um, with Montreal and Detroit and uh, and Buff and um, I think Buffalo. I think the Buffalo Sabers could be on the outside looking in as well. So I think so. Um, I think it'll be. I think it'll be I think it'll be a dogfight with with Buffalo, Detroit, and Montreal. So so and Florida too. So the Florida Panthers, you know, they might have a hard time getting in there as well. So, but I but um, but yeah, it's all all those four teams could have trouble getting in there. But Ottawa, I think Ottawa will. I think Ottawa. I think Ottawa will 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 be in last. Will, will be in in fourth place of uh, of making it to the playoffs. Um, as for the metro, I'm now the Metropolitan Division. Um, first place, um, the Pittsburgh Penguins will will be in first place in the in the Metropolitan. Second place will be the defending champions. The 2018 defending champions, the Washington Capitals, they'll be in second. They'll be in second place. Um, third, uh, 
third place in the in the metro will be the Columbus Blue Jackets because of uh, of uh, of uh, Tony uh, Tony Panarin and uh, and uh, Sergei Bobrovsky and uh, the fourth place the fourth place in the Metropolitan will be my Philadelphia Flyers. I think the Flyers will will make it in. I I I know I. I know I said the Flyers. Well, I know I said I wasn't going to make a prediction for the Flyers, but you know, if if they if the Flyers could get in, I think they'll probably make it in just pretty much like last year. They could be in seventh or eighth place in the Eastern Conference, or yeah, in the Eastern Conference uh, uh, race. I think so. I think um, Ottawa will be. I think the Flyers will be in. Seventh or eighth spot, maybe next to Ottawa and uh, and Columbus, but but I think it's going to be it's I think I think the Eastern Conference is, is going to be it's going to be jam packed. It's going to be a huge dog fight. I think um, I think the Islanders will be behind the Flyers, but I think it's going to it's going to be jam packed between. Climate, you know, climate in the playoffs. I, we expect the Rangers to do better, the Islanders, the New Jersey Devils, and the Carolina Hurricanes. So, I mean, do I think Jersey's going to be good? Maybe. I, th but I think I think everybody's expecting uh, the Carolina Hurricanes to do better. We'll see, but. I think the Flyers can, can can squeeze in there. And same thing with the Ottawa Senators. I think they can both squeeze in there as well. So um, um, I'm, I'm uh, 7 minutes and 15 seconds. So uh, if I can squeeze in the Western Conference, um, I will. So let's do it real quick. In the Central Division in the, in the Western Conference, um, I have the Winnipeg Jets win in first place. Um, I have St. Louis winning in second place. I think I we expect them to do well. Um, with the, uh, hopefully, uh, Petro Angelo will will have a good game. Nashville Predators, I think they'll win. In I think I think they could they they could get in there in third place. I have the Dallas Stars in fourth place. And um, you know, especially with Tyler with Tyler Sagan, and I and um, and and um, I think the Colorado Avalanche, they could they can get in get in there in fifth place. But I think the Colorado Avalanche can get in there. Um, so, and uh, Bruce Brujo has never missed the playoffs. He's a damn good coach. Or excuse me, rather. Um, well, for for the Minnesota Wild, I mean. But Jared Bednar, I meant I meant to say, Jared Jared Bednar is the head coach for, for the Avs. But the Colorado Avalanche are a very good young team. They have, you know, they um, they still, you know, they have, you know, um, you know, they Landeskog. He's he, he, he's still you know he's he's still a great player. I think I think you know Land Landeskog is a, a, a great great young player. And uh, and as for the Pacific Division, um, I have the Vegas Golden Knights in first place. They've done even though even even though even though I was against them last year, I I still think they're going to do well. Even though I'm not a Vegas Knights fan. You have, because you have great young talents, you have Max Pacioretty in in there as well, and uh, um, second place will be the San Jose Sharks. I think I were, I think the Sharks are gonna are are gonna do big this year. You have you have Joe you have Joe Thornton. He shaved his beard. Joe Thornton's gonna. Joe, we expect Joe Joe Thornton to do well. Uh, Brett Burns, I think he's gonna. I think he's gonna. I think he's gonna do phenomenal. 
I also think um, I also think uh, Pavelski will do well. And the goalie, uh, Matt Jones, I, we expect him to have a great season. And uh, but and 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 uh, and uh, last but not least, I think the Calgary Flames are going to make it make it to the playoffs this year. You got a new head coach, Bill Peters. Uh, you got you got my boy from South Jersey, dude. You got my boy from South Jersey, Johnny Goudreau. I think I think the Calgary Flames will will make it in there. So it's going to be. So, it should, and uh, you have Monahan and Giordano. I think I think they've been growing as a as a young team, but um, but getting back to the Eastern Conference, the uh, the only way the Montreal Canadiens the only way the Montreal Canadiens will do well this year if Carey Price has a good season, and, and as long as he doesn't get hurt, then they could do well, but. I wouldn't be surprised if if they don't if they don't make it uh, uh, this year. So, but getting back to the Western Conference, um, I don't think the LA Kings will make it to the playoffs, and I also don't think the Edmonton Oilers will make it either. I did say the Edmonton Oilers will make it to the playoffs last year, but this year they won't. I don't think I don't think Edmund, I don't think LA Kings will make it, Edmonton Oilers or the Anaheim Ducks. So, you know, sorry, Ducks Nations. I don't think, I don't think they're going to make it this year. But, but, but you know, anything can change in in, in in any in any given moment. So, but, but, um, I don't know who's going to win the Stanley Cup uh, this coming year for 2019. But I think I could be wrong. But I'm going to I'm going to say this anyhow. I have the Tampa Bay Lightning and the San Jose Sharks in the Stanley Cup Finals. Okay, there, so there you go. All right, everybody. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I appreciate you. Thanks for giving me your time as always. Uh, uh, I'm at work. I'm, at, I'm, at, I'm, on, I'm on my lunch break right now, so I'm almost 13 minutes in my video, so I will upload this video when I get home. So, uh, so, um, I, I will have more on my flyers maybe tomorrow or maybe this weekend but but um, so uh, as, as a Flyers fan that I am let's go Flyers and uh, we'll see what they do and uh, it's good it's a it will be a long season but but you know we have to look at the big picture to see what the Flyers can do I think they could, like I said, they could squeeze in there, but we'll see. You never know what's going to happen. So, all right, everybody, take care. Bye-bye.